Fox Talks with the stars of your favorite shows. Set in Brooklyn, it's a precinct of detectives. I play Detective Jake Peralta, who has uh, a knack for the job, but not a lot of respect for the system. Kind of a, a lone wolf. And Andre Brower plays Captain Holt, who's our new captain. He comes in and tries to sort of straighten everybody out, including myself, and we butt heads a little bit. To comedic effect. Jake is extremely handsome. Uh, he's got all the doodads that a detective would have, which makes the show super believable. Um, he's great at crime solving. He's kind of like Sherlock or the guy from elementary, but better and funnier. Well, doodad number one. He's got cuff doodads, he's got gun doodads. I just realized that I'm not wearing half of those, but He's got doodads. They're fantastic. Andre Brower is classic, uh, incredible actor. We've got a bunch of awesome, I guess you could call them new discovery style people and Chelsea Peretti and Melissa Fumero and Stephanie and Latrulio is hilarious. He's tried and true and Terry is amazing. So yeah, it's a really good core crew. Working with Andre Brower is not that different from working with Andre Agassi uh, in that they both love Fleetwood Mac. It's just a true fact. I'm not sure about Agassi, actually, but Brower is a big Mac head. I heard Andre Brower blasting Fleetwood Mac out of his trailer during production, which could not have made me more happy. The thing that I found most appealing about this show was that it was created by Dan Gore and Mike Schur, both of whom I knew previously and really like, both as people and as creative entities. Um, Parks is one of my favorite shows, and you know I love the, what Mike and Greg did with The Office, and it just seemed like if I was gonna do TV, I wasn't gonna get a better offer than this, um, where I get to you know headline and help in the creation of a, a show about stupid comedy detectives. So um, yeah, I mean it was really the, the opportunity to work with those guys that was the most appealing. We have done a little bit of training, uh, you know, so we don't look like children running around playing cops and robbers. I think we probably still do look like that, but um, with the magic of editing, I think it'll all work out. The most fun you have playing a detective is just pretending that you know how to shoot a gun. You know, there's nothing more badass than that. I've been making a lot of John McClane faces as I like walk down corridors, like stuff like that.